be out to survey a possible tornado. If confirmed, this is crazy, this would be the first tornado to hit Wisconsin in the month of February on record. What month is it? February. It's February. We shouldn't be dealing with this. This should be snow up here in Wisconsin. Yes. Instead, yeah. if you kind of quickly glance, you'd say, oh, snow. no, hill. Literally Hell. no one on their bingo card says there would be more tornadoes than snow reports yesterday. But we had, of course, that one in Grover Beach in California and asked is for mainly rain. And that comes in second half of the weekend, Monday into Monday night. Tuesday, could we mix with snow? Yes, it's quite possible. Are we going to be piling it up? Well, with a temperature of 41 degrees, that is going to be hard to do. We do drop to below freezing, but only to 31 by Tuesday night. But it's all it's going to be about the timing of enough cold air for you, I think, getting into Philadelphia. There's a better chance of getting into some accumulating snow farther north here of Philadelphia. We're talking about northeastern Pennsylvania, maybe from Wilkes-Barre, Scranton, over towards the Poconos, northern Jersey. Um, you know, even New York City, you've got a chance. Connecticut, Rhode Island, eastern Massachusetts, all of a chance of getting into snow. The GFS model has a similar footprint in terms of wear, but a little bit heavier amounts of snowfall. Now, let's look at the pieces coming together. So there's two things that have to phase, one coming in across the north, one coming in from the south. Here, depending on exactly where they set up, we'll have to determine you know, what kind of low we have, how strong it is even going into it. And then we watch the track of the low. How close does it get to the benchmark? That track right over the benchmark, which is this lat lawn right here, that really makes a difference as to the perfect position for the low to kind of have the right amounts of moisture, cold air in place to allow snow on the I-95. New York and Boston, you know, yes, there's, I would say, a decent chance. I think the really limiting factor is going to be how cold is it um, in this case here. That high pressure to the north, which brings in the cold air, is it strong enough?